Hello, it's me again. And now I'm back in my house during a blood moon because last time I f again forgot to watch my breath. And so I kind of died. And I was brought back all the way on my cave and now I have to survive this. Which isn't going to be easy, but luckily I have a lot new a lot of new ores, so I should be able to make some new gear, hopefully. Um take everything that I'd need out of my chests. Put away this money. Get the silver. Yeah, that's everything. And I'm trying to go do me some smelting. Silver. Oh yeah, that's a lot more silver. Iron. Well, I got a lot of copper. Now over to my anvil. Yeah, at least now my chances of survival have suddenly leapt up a bit. Granted, still not in a blood moon, but you know, still, I kind of I'll take what I can get really. Forty-five percent. Hmm. Although I could save iron by not making an iron hammer. I'm making a silver hammer instead. And then I already have a silver sword. So I don't need to make any iron tools now, do I? Because that's silver, iron, silver, and iron. Okay, so basically now it's all I need is silver tools really. And everything else can go towards armor. Copper greaves, copper chainmail. There we go. So that brings me up to six defense. And in terms of weapons, there's nothing more I can do. However, I can make potions. Even though it seems a bit wasteful now that I think of it, because I don't even have anywhere near 200 life. I could have just done with the regular ones. But I guess it's too late for that now, isn't it? Whoops. Anywho. Trying to go put things in my chests again. Oh, it's a silver copper bow, but I never used the bows anyway. Copper four. Silver four. Oops. Oh, and no, I don't need the hammer anymore. In fact, I'm going to put away this bow because I don't want it either. Fish. Gold. I hate all this inventory management. I might do a bit more of that off camera, but for now if I can get basically if I can get back into my cave I think I should be alright. Ow. Yeah, that is such a waste of a decent potion. But sadly I don't have any lesser potions now. Now then, I'm going to... How many lenses do I have? I think I have enough lenses. Because I want to make some cool looking goggles. Um, what does that take again? I think it's like two goggles. Huh. Could have sworn I had more lenses than that. But for some reason I don't understand where you're supposed to craft them. Because sometimes when I'm at the workbench, it doesn't let me craft lenses. Oh, hold on. I think I need like a workbench and a chair or something. I don't understand what a chair has to do with it, but I think I saw that when I was talking to the guide before. Actually, this blood moon doesn't seem too intimidating at all. I was expecting it to be a lot worse, but... As long as you have even a tiny bit of like... of a weapon then you're going to be relatively safe. Oops. Just finish off anyone who could drop down on top of me. Oh. Whoa. Yeah, I'm just going to run away and hide in here. Hopefully they'll try and come down after me instead of going up over that. 
Now I go up over around here. I just hate the way this path like takes so long to navigate every single time. It's all just walking and walking and walking until you actually get back to where you want to be. <laughs> and that's just digging and digging and digging. That's one of the problems with this kind of game. And as with Minecraft is that there are kind of aspects of monotony to it. Oh. Oh, that was a bit risky. That is a serious waste of platforms. Anyway, I have to heal up again. Okay, so this is where I'm going. Although I don't think I got very far after that last time when I was making the video. Maybe I got further than I thought. I'm just gonna try and retrace my backs, my retrace my steps back as well as I can. And I went over here. I remember digging through some mud. This is where I used the shine potion anyway. Which was probably a bad idea because then I wouldn't be able to see where I was going after that. Ooh. That bat actually just helped me. I can't see anything but I know the bat is still trying to kill me. There we go. Have we been up here? Oh yeah, I think I have. What I haven't done is very, very mistaken. I haven't been over here and I probably should have stuck with where I was in the first place because I wasn't because there was iron there and there was also some what's the other stuff called yeah. some of the blue stuff sapphires or something we're good I can't see anything I can just see where the skeleton is and that's all. There we go. Okay, so this is where I was. Because that's where the sapphire is. I don't care, I'm using this potion again. I need it. Stop forgetting to do that. I've realized I forgot to like start the timer so I know how long this video is going on for. So it might go on for too long again. I kind of forget. I keep on forgetting to time. Oh well. For now I'm just going to work on getting all the silver. That's that is what I need now. And then hopefully someday I will find an underground jungle. And then I can make myself all the equipment. That is somewhat easy to make in comparison to other things in this game. But still really, really, really effective wherever you go. Aside from underground, deep underground in the underworld. I believe I see more silver down here. And I'm going to do this the easy way. Or not? Ooh! Ah! <laughs> Whoops! I'm gonna stop wasting bombs now. That worked. And then there's more silver over to my left. 
the satisfaction. Which I feel very kind of underprepared. In other like files, in other worlds and stuff that I have, I seem to have a lot more kind of equipment and even just the special gold chest items I have a lot more. But in this one I just seem to be getting nothing anywhere. I can't believe I haven't found a chest, a proper chest yet. Very disappointing. Although I suppose I've been finding a lot of ores instead, so no. I can't be too greedy. This has to be enough for some iron armor anyway. And that's really the only use I can think of for armor now. There we go. And I'll go back over here where the big mama slime was. So you can drop mud on the enemies, only it doesn't seem to have as much of them as it does to you. It's kind of the same with sand. You can't seem to kill enemies using sand, but you can easily kill yourself with sand. Oh, keep away from me, I don't want to fall down here. So let's see, how am I going to get over here? Bridge! Oh, did I just waste my last potion? <laughs> that is so annoying. I really had to pay more attention. I mean, that doesn't even console me. The fact that there's gold right in front of me doesn't even console me from the fact that I just wasted my last potion. I have like four blue mushrooms left. And that is it. Why am I switching those? Now then I have to go in this gold. I think I'm going to end this video and start off the next episode just because I don't know how long. Wow. Gold, iron and copper. Even though I don't actually need copper anymore now because I have all the armor. I have all the tools. I've got better than the copper tools. So it's... Well, I can make chandeliers and a pocket watch. But other than that, I pretty much have no use for copper anymore whatsoever. That's what I meant in the earlier video about it becoming obsolete very, very quickly. I mean, this is like, what, my seventh video? And already it's... I don't really need copper anymore. I suppose it just, you know, saves me some time in mining things I don't need anymore. So, I'm going to end this video here and I'm going to start off again right from this spot, just so this won't go too long over. Okay. Goodbye everybody for now.